we're here at Glenda Martin's at in her sewing room, and you you all just have to see this, okay? I hey, Glenda, don't let anybody in here, and now I'm letting the whole world in here because I'm quite embarrassed about <laughs> the hoarding problem I have. <laughs> but I think most doll makers have it. So, oh my goodness, we are all so jealous. This is so cool. Okay, so tell me what's in here. What, what we okay, got? this is uh, my... So what's over here? What's this? Okay, this is... A lot of this is unfinished projects. Okay. A lot of this, a lot of little things that I um, am going to do something with someday. I have um, acrylic paints down here, chalk paints. Uh, all these are doll eyes. And then you've got... All these boxes is, up here, is I have a, a problem with boxes. <laughs> and I love boxes. So, all these are boxes. And I have... This is an area just to hold my... Um, let me see. Feathers and vintage flowers. Feathers. I, I definitely have a problem with all this stuff. Vintage feathers... More vintage flowers. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, so now the, what's this over here? And this is where I paint. It's actually a closet. I have a tiny little kiln that I can sit it down and, and put it directly in it. But I have paint brushes and every color of china paint I could possibly need. Um, sometimes I put inspiration things up so that I can decide that I'm going to do this project. Color chart. Um, real problem with brushes. <laughs> then you turn around, and these are some dolls that probably need to get dressed. They're asking for some attention, so they're sitting here. Okay. Definitely. Then if you have to turn around, look at this. Okay, this well, is... I'm going to walk over here so I can turn around and look. Okay. okay. All right, what point, what am I doing? This okay. is the painting area. Yeah. All right, and this is fabric here. I have lots of silk in drawers, all, silk. This is just normal fabric, and then all this is silk. Tons of silk that I have hoarded at Dolores and Guild conventions <laughs> for probably as long as probably 20, 30 years. I don't know. But it's here in case I need to do a project. And then this drawer is like uh, laces and trims that I can um, do projects with. Just, you know, sort of organized so that I can find them. Larger pieces, smaller pieces, just too much. It's ridiculous. Just I think open we, up. We're going to all want to go shopping in here. I, it's, it's funny because I was looking for some items to complete my project and realized I had more than most stores that I would <laughs> try, to, try to find some more stuff. Uh, but it's like eyelash pico. These are like... All these are silk ribbons down here, um, and bunka, and just different things. These so, more, and you've got your, uh, that's cool how you have your iron, your ironing board oh, there. Oh, yeah. They can come down. Then, these are some unfinished projects here. So, um, I mean, and then what's... And then here, well, these are patterns, and more unfinished, you know, leather tools, and hat, straw, patterns, um, more, mm -hmm. more silk. All these are... Drawers of silk, opens up just silk wow. items. And this is, in case I, I thought I might want to do jewelry, but the only jewelry that I do is like a little trinkets for my dolls. So this is all my hoarding for jewelry <laughs> that I'm going to do. Um, most of my uh, worksheets I put in binders and projects. If I'm going to do a project, I start a binder and I start collecting for instance i think this was like a gray doll that i did i found a, a neat antique doll picture and then i just start collecting information so that i can go to it whenever i do the project these are all my sewing machines and i have more there's one uh two three four five six sewing machines <laughs> and i do have a few more that are hidden down there but that's just in case one goes out, even though I do most of my sewing by hand. But 
that's that's that so you turn around it's pretty much packed um, that you can look in here these are every drawer I have had to organize it because I can't find anything if I don't it just it's all my thread embroidery thread everything is just in drawers Okay, well, so we're all really jealous right now. <laughs> <laughs> little button, little, uh, just, you name it. It's, it's all hoarded. Well, thank you very much, Glenda, for bringing us in here and giving us a little tour. We appreciate it. You're welcome. <laughs>the video end without showing you a little more about what Glenda has in those drawers. Vintage and antique feathers and flowers for hats. And she's got laces of just about every size and type, including a lot of antique.